Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the Jing Hill brand, their Bluetooth hearing aids for seniors. They're rechargeable with built-in digital chips with noise canceling and power display. This is the black color. Comes with instruction manual. This is the box that came in with different ear tips on there with different sizes, the unit itself. And you can see you could extend the warranty to 18 months. It comes with a one year warranty. And there's all contact information about the company on there, including a direct phone number, which is really nice. So you could scan that to get contact information. And then they have information about operation of the Bluetooth on here and listening to the music. Now, there's a lot of different hearing aid companies out there, and uh, they're all very different. And this company is different than the other ones because this is a unique product. Um, this company is a not only do you have dedicated customer service hotline and email that I showed right here to after sales support, but this is a professional hearing aid design and manufacturing company that has been established over 10 years. So this aid one is an FDA certified OTC over the over the counter hearing aid that has Bluetooth capability allowing you to connect to your mobile phone or other Bluetooth devices. Features four hearing modes to adapt to different usage scenarios. It's equipped with independent Bluetooth chips and digital sound processing chips providing superior sound and processing connection that most so-called Bluetooth hearing aids on the market do not have. Now this brand, this Jing Ho brand, is well known in the hearing aid industry been successful in selling hearing aids for many years. The product is specifically developed with digital signal processor and Bluetooth dual chips. And this is also obtained unique FDA certification and it's a genuine over-the-counter hearing aid. And with that over-counter hearing aids, there are a new category of hearing aids that consumers can buy directly without visiting a hearing health professional. They're designed to help adults with perceived mild to moderate hearing. So enough talk about the company. We're going to open this up and try everything out and see how well this works. So here's what's included. You have a little cleaning tool. You have USB-A to C charging cable. Air tips in black or gray and white, small, medium and large. And the unit itself. First thing you notice is there is a charging port on there with USB-C, very nice quality. You can see the hearing aids right here, there's a right and a left one. This is not the kind of style that goes over the top of your ear, this goes on the bottom of your ear to your canal, which generally are really comfortable to use. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to talk a little bit further about what technology is in here. This is a Bluetooth connectivity, you can easily connect these hearing aids to smartphones, tablets, other devices, logged into the stream audio directly to the ears. This feature is particularly useful for seniors who enjoy listening to music, watching TV shows or movies. What's nice is it'll switch to Bluetooth or not Bluetooth where it just amplify the sound that you hear. In addition to the features, the Bluetooth rechargeable hearing aids can also include a power display this display allows users to easily monitor the remaining battery life of the hearing aids. So you know, if they were running out of power, we're going to check that out. I think the display is on the bottom right there. This is the in-the-air design, comfortable and easy to wear for extended periods. The noise cancellation technology helps to filter out unwanted background noise, making it easier to hear conversations and other important sounds. Chargeable batteries in these hearing aids allow for longer battery life, reducing the need to constantly replace batteries. Now, my mother had hearing aids that you had to change the batteries and it was so annoying. This really solves that problem. Overall, Bluetooth rechargeable hearing aids, the power display are a great option for seniors who want an easy to use, high quality hearing aid solution that improves the overall quality of life. So, again, these are FDA uh, approved. They meet certain standards of safety and effectiveness. Um, a lot of other ones on the market, they're called PSAPs, are not regulated as medical devices and may not provide the same level of safety or performance. So let's, uh, first thing we're gonna try is we're gonna charge them. So here I have a standard USB-A output, one amp. 
uh, converter, which are really universal these days, and I have it plugged the USB-C into the back of the unit. And then there's a display right here, and it has a percentage on there. And if you look closely, you can see that the LEDs are breathing on the left and the right hand side. So what it's doing, it's charging those batteries inside the hearing aids. Now you also notice there's a percentage right there, and that's of the case itself. So if I unplug this, it's still charging the left and the right earpiece, and it gives the percentage of the case itself. If this doesn't come out automatically, you can hit this button right there, and that turns on the charging case allowing you to charge the batteries. This way you can bring this along on a trip or in your car, have it on the side of your bed and be able to charge them automatically or turn it on. And once it's done, it will shut itself down. So you get multiple charges out of this because internally there is a lithium polymer battery or lithium ion battery right inside here. Let's take a closer look at the unit itself right here. If you remove the right side, you can see the contacts right there, and those contacts will connect and mate to the contacts right there. Here's where you're going to put the pillows on, the one that's right for you. Like you see, it's blinking right there. It's probably trying to connect to Bluetooth. So in addition to that sensor that detects when you remove it out of your ear to save energy, it'll shut down. Whenever you put them back into the charging cradle, it'll continue to charge them and it'll shut them off for you automatically. And you notice that there is a left and a right and that you want to make sure you use the right and the right ear and the left and the left ear. And that blinking display on um, each hearing aid will go to a solid bar. It'll stop blinking and you can see that it just did that as I was speaking. They're now solid so they're fully charged. If you ever want to turn this display on or off, or you want to turn it off, you hold this for five seconds, and that will turn off the unit to save batteries until we're done charging. Okay, now they're fully charged, and I have the pillow on there. I chose the gray medium. You just push it right on place like that. Now if you look closely, let's look at the operation right here. You can see there is a plus and a minus. That's your volume down and volume up. The microphone is right there. It's picking up the sound. This is the transducer, the speaker that's making the sound in your ear. And these are the charging contacts that are conducting. Now there is a sensor on here. It's hard to see. Let's rotate this around until we find it. And if you look, there's a little circle right there. Anytime you block that or put this in your ear, the unit comes on. And when you remove it out of your ear, that sensor detects that and shuts it down so that you don't waste any energy. Very clever. So when you're taking calls in the Bluetooth, you can take a call by hitting the minus button. And if you hold a couple seconds down the minus button, it'll cancel the call or reject the call or terminate the call. So let's try and get the Bluetooth going. I have the hearing aids out and I've got my Bluetooth turned down on my Pixel 6 and you see it comes up with Jingho Aid 1. I'm going to hit that and I'm going to pair to it. And it's active, it shows 80% battery, gives me some feedback on the battery itself. Now, I should be connected now, and I should be able to go and stream some music on here. Uh, let's just uh, try something here. And let's put them on, let's see how it sounds. So right now, I'm listening to a song, and they're very comfortable. And it's stereo. And I walked all the way in the other room and they stayed connected nicely. And I have volume control on here, up and down. And if I get a call, I should be able to answer the call. We'll try that next. Now the manual talks about there's three or there's four different 
hearing programs. They have a little description right there. And you get beeps for the different ones. One beep, two beep, three beeps, four beeps. And what you do is you press and hold the plus button for about three seconds. So on the hearing aid, you hold this down, one, two, three, and then it goes into the different modes and it beeps to let you know that you're in those modes. One, two, three. And then when you have this on, you'll actually hear those different modes in there. And you could switch between those different modes depending on the environment that you are in. Okay, now I've got them in my ears and uh, I'm just uh, listening to them. Once in a while I can get feedback if I put my hand too close like this, but uh, it amplifies the sound of everything. I can hear uh, ticking of a clock even in another room. So you gotta get used to hearing aids, that's normal. And uh, once you get used to them, but they're very comfortable and it shouldn't take too long for you to adjust to having your sound enhanced. And again, there's those four different modes that you could implement for the different environments that you're in. So what do I think about this product? It works really well. Everything on it worked and uh, the sound of music was good. The call answering was okay and it amplifies the sound around me. So give these a try. I think you'd be happy with them. Um, I'm gonna give this product a full five-star rating. I hope this video review helped you with your buying decision. Thank you for watching.